Yes, I'm wearing the same exact outfit from yesterday's video, but y'all understand the YouTube magic. Your boy can sit here and record 10 videos in a row and upload for 10 straight days and y'all will have no idea unless I didn't change my outfit and that's what I'm doing today's video. I've been having technical difficulties. So while I have everything working, I'm going to sit here and, and react to a bunch of bunch of highlights so I can make sure I have videos out for y'all. Today we're watching every team's worst play since 2010. Link is in the description to the original content creator. As always, let's get into it. Low lights are also just as fun as highlights in a lot of situations. Um... Because it can be so damn funny. All right, let's go. No one is safe from making bloopers. Yep, the Draymond's ridiculous. When they happen, they are embarrassing. Mistakes happen to the best of us. Dang, hold the on, Bagley. Bagley was iced out here. You see the ice? Okay, I'm sorry. I don't want to pause it as much as. Anyway, iced out. On a court in front of thousands of people. In this video, we are going to take a look at the worst blooper from. Every oh man, Javale McGee, the poster king. Every of bloopers. Oh, J.R. Smith blooper. Oh, man. It don't get worse than NBA Finals game one, not knowing the situation and everything. Again, link is in the description to this guy. I, I just found his channel, and so far it's been amazing. Real GOAT right there. Atlanta Hawks. Worst play of the decade for them. In the playoffs. In the playoffs. Oh, man. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, the Atlanta Hawks lost that series, but I could be mistaken. No, he didn't just miss his dunk and thought that he made it. He missed his dunk, thought that he made it, and was showboat into the crowd. And then walks into Jermaine O'Neal, who double dribbles because of it. Who is that? Number 12. Number 12. Von Wafer. Oh, my God. These are bad Boston Celtics teams. Von Wafer. Jesus Christ. Brooklyn Nets. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, my God. Oh my god. It don't get worse than that. That is the worst air ball I've ever seen in the NBA game. I've seen worse at the rec league, but drilled her, bro. I mean, she's probably okay because it's just a basketball. But drilled her. Boop. Okay. Chicago Bulls. First of all, there's a lot of low lights in these Chicago Bulls teams. A four on one fast break. What are they gonna do? Turn the ball over. Oh, that's so hard to watch. A four on one. Four on one. And look who's on the court for us. We are probably one of the best. One of the best. Fast break runners in NBA history, Rondo. But he don't get the ball to run this fast break. Michael Carter-Williams turns it over on a four on one. Ridiculous. And we know we knew this one was coming. We knew this one was coming. What are you doing, bro? What are you doing, bro? And LeBron can't believe it. The LeBron had like 50 this game. LeBron had like 50. All right. Tyson Chandler with the board. He gives it to Rondo. I forgot Rondo played here. That's because Rondo got benched. That's why I don't remember it too much. A second violation. Oh, he probably got benched after this, right after this play. There's no excuse to have a second violation in a basketball game. And then he gave up the three. Rick Harlow's like, cut it. I'm sorry. You can't play for us no more. Okay. JaVale McGee, what's up? Oh, come on. Come on, JaVale. Uh Bro, JaVale McGee's career arc is ridiculous. He went from Shaq and a fool MVP 17 times to two-time NBA champion, potentially three-time if the season finishes up. Come on, man. Great career arc. And he's actually a player now. And that's loose. Boy, they are, they are totally Tobias, hello. Okay, look at Klay Thompson. Oh, no. Oh, no. He was just celebrating. Come on, Steph. We we would expect you to just take that shot. It's not. It's, you're the best shooter of all time. Let's let's just let it ride. Rockets. Okay. Let's see what they got. Lonzo Trier makes a free throw. Oh yes. This is this is recently. This is recently. Oh my God. No way. What is PJ Tucker thinking? It's just like sometimes we just have these brain farts, and Eric Gordon cannot believe it. Sometimes we just have these brain farts, bro. We just it just happens to everybody. Oh, Lance Stevenson catches a glass. But 
but but but okay he gets the block but he gives up on the play because he takes us over and Michael K. Gilchrist gets the bucket okay Chris Paul oh 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 DeAndre Jordan didn't go up with it DeAndre Jordan didn't go up with it first of all that ball goes in basically halfway through <laughs> look at little man Chris Paul <laughs> D'Angelo <clears throat> We gotta act like that didn't happen, D-Load. We act like that it happened, D-Load. <laughs> Before we get into the next play, I'd like to talk about today's Um, I respect him for getting sponsors, but I they not sponsor me, so we're gonna keep it moving. Okay. Okay, buckets. Nope. Nope. Oh, no, not four layups, Tony. Listen, Tony Allen's known as one of the best defenders, perimeter defenders in recent NBA history. He just, offensively, he ain't really have it like that. So this four, four layups? Okay. Miami Heat. Hassan Whiteside, he gave it back to Norris Cole. Yeah, what are you doing, bro? And this is late in the game. This is late in the game. He sold. He sold, bro. It's 40 seconds in this game. Nerlis Noel inbounds it and Hassan gives it back to him and Nerlis gives it. <laughs> oh man. Oh, this is the missed layup for Brandon Knight. This is supposed to this is for game. He missed it. For game. He missed it. Oh man. A bunch of low lights for Brandon Knight, by the way. A bunch of low lights for Brandon Knight. And it just don't get worse than this one. Oh man. Okay. Alright. Gorgi Zhang, what are you doing, big fella? Good tipping, though. I mean, if it was on the other side of the court, that's a bucket. You know what I'm saying? Demarcus, what are you doing? He gets dunked on, too, doesn't he? Yeah, he gets dunked on. <laughs> you get dunked on, too? By cancer? All right, speaking of the Knicks, Lexi's flat brain heard that name in a very long time. What are you doing? These are bad, bad Knicks teams. And I know the Knicks ain't good now, but these are the worst of the worst Knicks teams. Oh, Russell Westbrook just doesn't dribble the ball and he travels. He just doesn't dribble the ball at all. And then it took the ref some time to realize what was happening. He was almost at half court before the ref realized, hold on. He's not dribbling the ball. <laughs> And I think KD ended up doing something similar. 4 on 1 fast break. Mario Hazonia tries to get cheeky with it and turns it over. That's when being flashy bites you in the butt. And Smith said, Thank you very much. <laughs> okay. Marco Bellinelli gives it to Ben Simmons. Honestly, that's not that terrible. Missing the dunk ain't that bad. The Von Wafer one was worse because he missed the dunk. He was looking at the crowd talking, and then he caused the turnover. Missing dunks, it kind of kind of happens. You know what I'm saying? Jason Richardson. See, this situation is worse because, I mean, this is a tie game. Like, this becomes a tie game with 40 seconds left. The Ben Simmons one, he still got five minutes to make up for it. Okay. Wesley Matthews. What a bucket. You know, just a little slippery on the palms, you know, no big deal. Alonzo G is guarding him. Jesus Christ, these are bad, bad teams. Wow. Boogie. Less than a second left. They need a bucket. He throws it up. Um, they probably had better playmakers on the team. And he hits himself in the head with the ball. All right, Davis, it's all right. You probably got benched because Popovich don't play that, but it is what it is. He tries to throw it up, and what the heck? And sniped himself. Oh, my God. Oh, DeMar. He tried to get fancy with it and left it short. And then I, uh, uh, he tried to get fancy with it at the guard. And you know what? The guard brings that out of people. Everybody wants to be special with the guard. One second left on the clock. Beautiful.
JaVale. Hey, listen. If I mean, if he don't lose that ball, that's an amazing in-game dunk. And it's just a whole compilation of them. Oh, my God. Who is that? I can't even see who that is. James Jones. Jesus Christ. All right, those are the most embarrassing moments or the worst plays for the 2010s from every single team. If you enjoyed it, leave it a like, and we'll be back.